Hi, I'm Margaret Reed McDonald, and I have stories that are so simple to tell that you can tell them too. And this is one of them. It's from Appalachia, and it's called Jack and the Robbers. Once there was a boy named Jack, and he went out to seek his fortune. He went along, and he went along, and he met a dog. And the dog said, woof, 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 where are you going, Jack? I'm going to seek my fortune. Can I go with you? Certainly, said Jack. Come along. And off they went. Jiggity jog, jiggity jog, jiggity jog, jiggity jog, till they met a cat. And the cat said, meow, meow, meow. Where are you going, Jack? I'm going to seek my fortune. Can I go with you? Certainly, said Jack. Come along. Jiggity jog, jiggity jog, jiggity jog. Jiggity jock, till they met a rooster. And the rooster said, Cock a doodle doo, cock a doodle doo, cock a doodle doo. Where are you going, Jack? I'm going to seek my fortune. Can I go with you? Certainly. Come along. And off they went. Chickity chock, chickity chock, chickity chock, till they met a bull. And the bull said, Bull, bull, bull. Where are you going, Jack? going to seek my fortune. Could I go with you, Jack? Certainly. Come along. And off they went. Chickity jock, chickity jock, chickity jock, chickity jock. Up the hill, down the hill, through the valley. Up the hill, down the hill, through the valley. Up the hill, down the hill, through the valley. Up the hill, down the hill, through the valley. Till it got dark. Where can we sleep, said the animals. Leave that to me, said Jack. Jack saw a house on the hill. He climbed the hill. He looked in the window. There were three robbers in there, counting out their gold. Here's what we'll do, said Jack. He put the bull by the window. He put the dog on the bull's back and the cat on the dog's back and the rooster on the cat's back. He said, when I give the signal, you make your most ferocious noise. Everybody has to make a really ferocious noise at this point in the story. One, two, three. Whoa. The robbers had never heard a noise like that before in their lives. They looked inside and they saw an animal that was part dog and part rooster and part cat and part bull. And they'd never seen an animal like that before. They threw their money in the air and they ran out the door and down the hill. They never came back. Jack and the animals went inside that house and they counted out the money. And there was a bag of gold for the bull and a bag for the dog and a bag for the cat and a bag for the rooster and a bag for Jack too. Yes. And next morning, back, they went the way they had come. Chickadee chock, chickadee chock, chickadee chock, chickadee chock. Up the hill and down the hill and through the valley. Up the hill and down the hill and through the valley. Up the hill and down the hill and through the valley. Up the hill and down the hill through the valley. Chickadee chock, chickadee chock. Till they came home rich. And that is the story. Now that story is so simple. Did you see it was so simple? Just three parts, jiggity jog going, up the hill, down the hill, got dark, scared them, went back home. You can learn to tell that story so easily. Be sure the kids do all the motions with you, the jiggity jog, jiggity jog, up the hill, down the hill, making all the horrible noises with you. And when you get back, jiggity jog, very quiet, till you get home to calm everybody down. And then once you've told the story to your kids, you know what you should do? Tell it again. And again and again and again, because they love hearing the same story over and over and over, and that's how you get good at telling. And then after you've told it a few times, say, do you want to play the story? Who wants to be Jack? Who wants to be the cat? And you can act it out. You can say all the parts and let them follow along, or they can even say the parts. Have a lot of fun with this story of Jack and the robbers. And it's from a book called 20 Tellable Tales that I wrote. And you can tell the story too. Just get the book from your library if you need to. But if you just listen to me tell it four or five times, you won't even need to get the book. You can just tell the story.